Salutations, this is Grim Devel. Welcome back to our Let's Play of Cataclysm. Dark days ahead. We are Grim Devel, the summoner, Baraki of Chebriados, with three pips of piety. Very nice. And um, we went down to Lair last episode, and we were immediately accosted by a basilisk, four yaks, and a four-headed hydra. Uh, we killed a basilisk, but I don't really want to go back down there right now. So we're going to try this vault here. I'm going to cast everything we got. We should be able to cast three of these, right? Yes. And then a dog. Oh, nice. We got a wolf. And then I think that's enough. I'm going to open this door and move away. Let me cast uh, an imp too. Good. Cast another ice beast to replace the fallen ones. Oh, and the dog went. Let's get another dog. Good, we got another wolf again. We can help kill that ogre. Good. Oh, good. We're flanking the uh, ant. This is this is working out well, I think. Uh, we only have two um, mana. We do have a potion of magic, though. Um, you know what? I'm going to use Wand of Flame. Okay. Nice. Is that it in the vault? That was it. We did it. Nice. Some gold. Wand of Ice Blast. Very nice. Blinking. Awesome. Oh, and I didn't even sell, see the spell book before. Oh, and this is a transmutation spell book, isn't it? Translocations. No, only Passage of Galubria is translocations. But as a Baraki worshiper of Chebriados, translocations is one of the more important spell schools. Um, we're going to want whatever translocations we can get. Uh, you can see swiftness we cannot cast because we're a worshiper of Chebriados. Chebriados hates it. Um... Pass wall is castable. Transmutation Earth. It's interesting because we have neither transmutations or Earth. Um, what are our ad, um, abilities here? We actually get a plus one to translocations and transmutations. Is it worth memorizing Passage of Galubria and working towards some translocations? I think we will want translocations. Um, Passwall could be important to get out of dangerous situations. But I think Passage of Galubria is going to be really important for us long term. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to get it. We have eight spells right now. And let's get some translocations. It's they they will not go to waste. Let's train it to six. Not going to focus it yet. We're we did reach our spell casting target for, uh, yeah, our spell casting target. We're still working on ice and air, although we're almost at our air target as well. And invocations. I don't know if I want to set a fighting target. Fighting is always good. It raises your hit points. And while we are a magic user, fighting is important. Like, we are using our long blade. I think we're okay with the spell casting for now. Maybe not. Maybe I want to be training it the whole time. We're okay. This is fine for now. Okay. That was good. So that scroll of blinking makes me a little more confident about going into lair. Uh, how comfortable do I feel? If we do, we would want to equip our long sword of flaming because then we could actually attack the hydra. Do we try this? We can immediately go back up if we want, but we might be surrounded by a bunch of things. 
Let's see. Okay. We're surrounded by a bunch of yaks, but not the Hydra. Okay. We are going to hop out of here. Whoops. Nice hop. We're going to cast some Ice Beasts. And a doggy. Very good. That, wor that worked out well. Okay, so now there's only one Yak and, of course, all of the... Uh, and the Hydra, which is scary. I think we can do it. Yep, we're gonna hop away, first of all. Okay. We're gonna Ice Beast. And again, back up. Let's help kill this Hydra. All right, and it has three heads. Great. And we'll kill this thing. Okay. Let's uh, re-equip the Falchion. Uh, what did that say? Translocations is level one. Ice Magic eight. Invocations four. Great. So now we're not training Invocations anymore. Or Air Magic. Let's check our spells. Lightning Spire is at 8%. Summon Ice Beast, 2%. Do I want to get air up a little higher? Let's get air up a little higher. Let's get it up to 4. Which is the level that... Uh, that Lightning Spire is. Uh, invocations... So right now, Temporal Distortion's at 21%. Bend Time's at 3%. I think we will want more invocations to, to reduce the, the failure chance of the piety abilities. We are going to want more invocations. I think we're going to want... You know what? I think the higher abilities, I think I was reading that you want about 14 for a low chance. I'll put it on. Not it's it, it kind of stinks, but those abilities are going to be really important for us. I miscast the uh, okay, go get it. Oh, that's a whole pack. Let's get our own wolf. Uh, let's get some, yeah, some imps. Uh, let's get another Ice Beast. Oh, I don't have any mana. Oh, this isn't good. Let's get another Ice Beast. I think, wait, how much mana does it cost for an Ice Beast? I can't do it. I can cast a dog, which I will do. Good, it's a wolf. Oh, I didn't think that thing would be able to get around. That's interesting. I thought we had them bottlenecked. I'm going to hop away then. Not a great hop. Because that, that one, while I was confused, I was going to attack it again. I'm going to start backing away here. Uh, We could bend time. Oh, no, not until we have three magic points. It's a good reason to keep magic points. We reposted. Good. We're a formidable fighter against things like, you know, things that aren't too tough. I wasn't too, like that wolf, one at a time, wasn't too scared. Although, that could have bitten me in the in the butt. Um, go kill that frog. Let's peek down here. Wyvern. Um, what kind of resistances do you have? You're fine. Ooh. Okay. Summoning's increased. Summoning's... Yeah. Okay. Lightning Spire's at 7%. I don't like water moccasins, although we do have poison resistance. Let's get a nice beast. 
I try to get a lightning spire? Let's back up first. Let's try lightning spire. Oh, you don't get to... Pl right, I think it's been a while since I actually used it. You used to be able to place it in a particular location. You can't do that anymore. But there we go. That was our first spire. Cane toad. Uh, these used to be called spiny toads, I think, or spiny frogs, and they are now named after the um, actual real-life Australian menace. They are red, though. Are they they're resistant to poison? Sting for up to 26 damage and cause poisoning. Cold-blooded. Let's get one of these down. All right. Nice. Uh, and we got a book of changes, which I don't think we're going to be using. I don't think. Transmutations. Yeah, we do have uh, some aptitude for it, but um, I don't think... We can't spit, uh, spread ourselves that thin. An iron ring. Do I have any... Right, do have remove curse. Let's put that ring on, see what it's all about. Instead of stealth. Oh, a curse ring of attention. Great. Uh, let's remove curse. And uh, drop that dang ring. And uh, put that ring of stealth back on. It's, it's pretty nice, actually, for us. Hopefully they didn't cause monsters to know exactly where we were. Okay. Speak down here. Okay. Another teleportation. Very nice. A little auto explore action. Another scroll of remove curse. Which do we. What do we have? I think I can drop this robe at this point. Um, we'll keep the kite shield, I guess. You know what? No, we're going to drop it. We can always come get it later if we decide we want to have your shield. But I don't really want to put the points into the shield at the, right now. Do I? Hmm. Don't drop the shield. We've got this thick smoking staff, too. Let's wield that. Staff of poison. Okay. Okay. Uh, let's drop that staff of poison. We're not going to be using it right now. What's wrong with me? Where is it? Where's that staff? There it is. Um, the kite shield. Skill to remove the penalty is 15. Now, for most mages, that's pretty... It, it's, it takes a long time to get up to, to there. But we do have a plus one aptitude for shields. We've already gotten it to four. We're not going to do it yet. It, it, it would be very nice because it just gives you a lot more armor um, and blocking. And I think we might want to do it, but we're, we're still spread really thin right now. At a certain point, we might want to really focus on shields and get that up, but we're not there. When we get there, we'll come back and get the shield. I think there's another kite shield somewhere also that we've seen. Moto Dragon, okay. Go get it. Um, cast a spire too. All right, the spire cast uh, costs four mana. It seems. Really. Good. It was a little scary. The potion of magic. Um, that basilisk by itself is okay. Let's cast a few beasts. Got a spire. Go get it. Okay. Cane Toad again. Uh, this is, again, I think fine. Come on down. Well, that... That... 
was uh, pretty easy. It counts. It counts as red, so I was thinking it was gonna. These things are gonna be harder than they actually are. So I'm really preparing, and then and then everything's fine. Another cane toad. Okay. Back up. I'm not gonna cast the spire this time. Just go get it. Yeah, I'll cast the spire now. Why not? Yes, super easy. All right, new scroll. I don't have any identifies, do I? I do not. Okay. Done exploring. Okay, that's layer one. Okay. Oh, a new book. Uh, okay, minor magic. Nothing here is super exciting for us, I don't think. Blink. Blink is. Blink is exciting for us. Um, yeah. Let's memorize Blink right now. We don't have a lot of spell levels left, but look, we can immediately cast Blink if we get into trouble at 5% failure. That's another translocation which we are currently training. Very, very good. Okay, let's check down here. At a certain point, we might get rid of our canine uh, spell. We'll get behind our spire. But our no, our our ice beast took took care of it, no problem. Oh, okay. All right, it it doesn't. Let's get this guy. Let's get some beasts. Good. They won't take any chances. It's weird that we can just spam spells without worrying about spell hunger. And maybe I'm not doing it right. Maybe that's really gonna bite me in the butt. I keep saying bite me in the butt in this series. Um, with uh, with the clock, I don't know. If there's some big disadvantage, I'm not understanding. So it looks like the entrance to Swamp is around here. Last time we saw Swamp Worms, they devastated us, but that was a while ago. Don't think that's going to happen again. Mm, I will hop away here. Good. We're level 11. Also, look at our abilities. We're only level 11, and all of our abilities are in the 20s, thanks to Che. Hell rats, huh? Um, I think our ice attack should do very well against that. Ooh, let's cast um, Spire. That's a bunch of stuff. Uh, let's get another ice beast. Uh, uh oh. Hop. We're, there's no good place to run away here, and we don't have a lot of magic. I want to keep at least three mana in case we need to cast, um, in case we need to cast Bend Time. Oh, oh, we have, um, we can cast Slouch now. We need five magic to do it. But that's awesome. So yeah, cause damage to everyone in sight who is moving faster than you, dealing damage, more damage with greater differences in speed. Uh, the Swamp Worm probably can't move very fast, but the Wyvern, oh wait, neither can the Leech. Actually, how fast can they move? Can I move faster? Um, yeah. Show me the Tyrant Leech. It is slow, but swims quickly. Probably not as slow as we are, though. We're very, very slow. Um, I have... Ice Blast. And I can use it on all three of these things. Perfect. Let's do that again.
Not bad. Uh, let's throw some poison darts. Uh, is the swamp worm... No, it's not poison resistant. Let's do that. Okay, let's let's just use the um, ice blast again. Great. Excellent. All right, so we reached our ice and air targets. We're at. We actually have like a reasonable amount of skills we're training now. Um, let's see. Blinks at 4%. Summon Ice Beast, even though it's at 1%, is still yellow. Summon Lightning Spires at 5% is yellow. And Galubri is 28%. We're still training Translocations, though. And we're still training Summonings. We are not focused on anything. Do I want to focus on anything? It would be huh. maybe spell let's let's do more spell casting. Let's get that up. And I think that'll help the yellow go to white. I'm not 100 percent sure if that's how it works, but I'm hopeful. I think spell casting is probably a good idea for us. We're not focused on anything right now. Everything's getting, every skill is getting the experience equally. So there's the lair to swamp, the entrance to swamp rather. And swamp, swamp in this new version has changed, I think more than any other branch. Um, apparently there's a whole host of new enemies that are all in swamp, which is scary. We don't need to go up that because we're not in dungeon. Boomerangs. I think uh, the lightning bolts are good against flying creatures, so I'll put that down first. Good. We'll check out what's down here after we get our mana back. Okay. I'm kind of shocked that we even made it to Lair. <laughs> uh, Black Mamba. I think we have a lot of poison resist. Lightning Spire. It's not the side I wanted it on. No, I don't like it. Go up. Oh, it did poison us. Let's exclude the stair. I don't want to take it from that side. Okay, done exploring. Black Mamba was up there. Let's get some Ice Beasts preemptively. Uh-oh. Oh, good. That was good placement. It killed the spire, but um, good. Black Mamba died. We can kill this moccasin. Good. Leave that toad alone for a second. Cane toads are now yellow, which seems more reasonable. Oh, there goes my computer again. Please kill that toad. Good, thank you. Attributive darts. Another mystery scroll. Quoto dragon, that's okay. Nice. Okay. I think the bolt of the uh, lightning spire killed it. So you can see. The how nice that is. Elephant. And where there's one, there's going to be more. Oh, uh, more charges for a wand of paralysis there. Um, yeah. Let's get a spire. We miscast spire. Okay. 
don't super like this. Do I back away? There's the staircase up there. Do I try to get to the staircase? Or can we actually fight these things one at a time? If I get into like a, uh, into a good corner. Or would that kill us? How many scrolls of teleport do we have? Three? I, wanna, I think I'm going to keep our piety here. Let's, let's hop away. Let's hop down here. Good hop. Another beast. All right, Lightning Spire is getting a bunch of hits in here. Oh, nope, they killed it. Okay, these things could trample. Here's what we're going to do. We're going to get in here and see how, we, how well we do against these elephants one at a time. Do I have might? I do. Hmm, do I want to use it? Maybe not quite yet. Ooh, you know what? Let's mite it up. Oh, yeah, you're... Oh, that toad, too. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, heal wounds. I don't like this anymore. Teleport. How much damage can you do? 25. Still mighted here. Uh oh, okay. Um, dang it. Sorry about that. Sorry about that scratchiness. That's my computer again. It put us right where there's an Oclob plant, which is not fantastic. We're gonna hop away. Ooh, ooh. Oh, that's uh, the Akla plant. Also getting hit by this thing, okay. This, this isn't terrible. Let's get a lightning spire because I don't think that'll be affected by the Akla plant. Oh, but I don't wanna walk into the zone where we might fall asleep. Hoping we get hot back soon. Fortunately, all these wolves are asleep. That was good. All right, we can hop. Hop over there. Good. Let's get another ice beast, I think. Uh, and we failed to cast it. Wonderful. Right, that's a lot of stuff. Uh, I'm going to drink one of the potions of magic. Because we need more help. Yeah, summon ice beast. Another one. I was too, I was too quick. I was too quick to be like, cast more, cast more. I, I didn't look at how many hit points we had. And uh, how much damage that Komodo dragon could do. I was too focused on. Uh, I, I was just too acted too ha too uh, too rashly, too quickly. And we're dead. Minus one. It hit us for just enough to do um, two more hit points than we had. That's very sad. I thought we were. I thought we were doing pretty well. 
I shouldn't have attacked those elephants. I mean, we were, I mean, the elephants were coming at us one way or another. It was not a great teleport away. That was unlucky, but we hadn't explored a lot of this level. It was a risk. We could have blinked. We could have done anything. We could have done a bunch of stuff. We were still mited, by the way. Um, and maybe if I had gone down those stairs, who knows what's at the bottom of there, though. Well, Baraki Summoner of Chebriados is hard. I still am not doing well with this build. Um, I don't know if this is the farthest I've gotten. I'm not sure. We got to layer three. Not amazing. Not amazing. This is like still the end of the early game. But um, that's it. And I don't think we're going to be trying it, trying Baraki of Chebriados on my channel again for a while. But I hope you enjoyed this series. Uh, I did. It's good to get back into DCSS. Um, unfortunately, I don't think I'm going to be finishing a game during the tournament, but that's okay too. Uh, we'll definitely be playing more DCSS on my channel, hopefully in the near future. I really enjoyed playing with you, and I will see you next time. Um, well, let's actually look at what we had here. I guess I could have worn that troll leather armor. I don't know if that would have really helped us too much. Could have used, could have used ice blast, paralysis... Those are all lizards. They might have been, no, they're dogs too. And that and they uh, the rhyme drake. We don't have anything that's effective against that. He has some enchant armor. Yeah. So yeah. There we are. I enjoyed playing with you, and I will see you next time. Bye everybody. <laughs>